Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Bob, CEO and founder of Crypto Icon Media and you are watching Crypto Icon, a show where I talk about everything around crypto, Web3 and blockchain technology. So today we will take a look at some of major crypto news and some hot updates, but please note that I'm not a financial advisor, it is just for information and entertainment purpose. So let's go for it. But before that, I'm just going to talk about current market price. So today's cryptocurrency price by market cap, the global crypto market cap is $1.28 trillion, which is uh, 0.77% decrease over the last day. The total crypto market volume over the last 24 hours is uh, $48.50 billion, which makes a 12.56% decrease. The total volume in, De in DeFi is currently $4.79 billion, which is 9.88% of the total crypto market 24 hour volume. The volume of all stable coin is now $43.27 billion which is 89.20% of the total crypto market 24 hour volume. Bitcoin dominance is currently 46.12% a decrease of 0.27% over the day. And uh, today's Bitcoin price is $30,362. Ethereum price is $2,098. BNB price is $332. And let's go for the today's story. Okay, the first story is coming up from uh, Cointelegraph.com. So I would like to give this credit to Cointelegraph.com. And the story says MetaMask, the third party provider, hacked exposing email addresses. <clears throat> the incident affected users who submitted a MetaMask customer service ticket between August 1st, 2021 and February 10th, 2023. The email address of some MetaMask users may have been exposed to a malicious party due to a recently discovered uh, cybersecurity incident. According to parent company consensus, the incident affected users who submitted a customer support ticket to MetaMask between August 1st, 2021 and February 10th, 2023. According to the April 14 blog post, unauthorized actors gained a access to a third party com computer system that was used to process customer service request potentially allow them to view customer support tickets submitted by metamask users and let's go for the second story all right second story is coming from coming up from bitcoinist.com so i would like to give this credit to bitcoinist.com and the story says defy under fire sec it's a uh, intensified crackdown sparks a uh, controversy decentralized finance is facing increased regulatory security as the securities and exchange commission uh, reopened the comment a period on proposed amendment to the definition of exchange under exchange act rule 3b16 the proposed amendment were initially put forward in January 2022 and the SEC reopened the comment period in May 2022 which closed on June 13, 2022. The SEC uh, proposal aims to provide regulatory oversight a platform that trade crypto asset to what they called securities including DeFi protocols which operate on a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer network. Let's go for the third story. All right. So th third story is coming up from Cointelegraph.com. So I would like to give this credit to again Cointelegraph.com. And the story says Celsius reportedly preparing uh, a litigation against uh, creditor for leaking internal info. Creditor Tiffany Fong argues she hasn't done anything wrong, uh, asserting that she didn't break any non disclosure agreement by reporting on the leaked information. A court filing incident uh, indicates that a bankrupt crypto lender Celsius network either uh, intended to or is potentially considering legal action against crypto blogger and Celsius creditor, uh, creditor Tiffany Fong over leaking inter internal information. Let's go for the last story. Okay, so the last story is coming up from AMBcrypto.com. So I would like to give this credit to AMBcrypto.com. 
and his story says decoding how Ethereum Chappella upgrade uh, impacted the staking market. It's a uh, Ethereum Chappella update uh, cost is taking to withdraw million of dollar worth of ETH is sparking concern and optimism uh, as funding rates ra rise and the market remain under suitable and uh, the Chappella update uh, triggered the withdrawal of thousands of ETH worth millions of dollars. Despite concern about market impact, Ethereum investors remained optimistic as the price de uh, defied uh, prediction and stayed above $2,000. Let me scroll it down. The recent ETH uh, Chappella update but about the long-awaited unlocking of stake ETH. This development was made with mixed prediction from various quarters. While some analysts uh, foresaw a decline in ETH market value, it triggered a return to the previously established price range. As the unlocking of stake ETH gradually gained momentum, it, back, it backs the question of how stakers have responded to it. Also, what it the value of a stake that have been withdrawn uh, thus far. More than 30 hours have uh, its lapsed since the implementation of the Chappella update, and it has been met with significant transaction. According to it, its uh, Ether scans latest data, stakers have withdrawn thousands of Ethereum. Uh, with millions of dollars as of this writing close to 150,000 withdrawals of over 270,000 ETH was recorded all right and guys this is the end of the story today if you like the content of this video please give me thumbs up and press the subscribe button also press the notification bell icon so you will receive more content like this every day and don't forget to check out our official link of major crypto platform in the description of this video and i would love to hear your feedback and suggestions so do comment your thoughts below and guys please share this video with your friends on social media facebook twitter and instagram at bob ashish and also at crypto icon media to learn more about our company and uh, let me talk about what exactly we do crypto icon media is a full service interactive crypto media agency digital marketing social media and branding and guys, if you are listening to uh, this content on Apple Podcasts, Spotify or any other podcast platform, then do hop on our YouTube channel for the real action. And guys, if you want to get 100 USDT, so get world biggest crypto exchange Binance and deposit more than $50 into your Binance account and we will both get 100 USDT as a cashback voucher. Thank you once again. Have a great day. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Catch you soon.